we uh, met a few doctors. Uh, they said uh, us to do x-rays, so we did it. <laughs> or, or we succeeded. <laughs> Greetings from uh, public sauna of Delhi. Uh, definitely. Uh, well said. Good morning. Yes. Yeah, so our plan of today is like uh, a little bit strange and unknown. Yeah. Because yeah, we're going to get a nice breakfast in a too expensive place. Yeah. Well, relatively expensive, but a very, very proper place. We already made a commercial for it, so maybe we'll not do another one. Yeah. <laughs> we don't get paid, so... Yeah, then... Maybe we'll go to the hospital. Yeah, a hospital. Why yeah. not? Yeah, because our mom, she felt in the shower and she have a pain in her, like... Um, ribs. Yeah, ribs area. Yeah, so it might be broken, it might not be broken, we don't know. So that's why we are going to a good private hospital. Uh, which is about five kilometers from here and uh, also she should get the insurance uh, so that's why maybe we can use the insurance money <laughs> yeah to cover <laughs> yeah to cover. expenses of this journey <laughs> yeah <laughs> yeah and um, hi then maybe at the evening we'll try to find a guy just like in Europe you cannot find this kind of guy who just sits in the streets and uh, repairs shoes yeah yeah so basically we need to repair our shoes uh, maybe we'll film how he's pre uh, yeah, repairing we'll try, because they are really experts I repaired my many shoes in, in many locations in India just in, in the places like simple streets you can find those guys and uh, yeah we'll, we'll see um, what else? Yeah, and uh, we would like to announce like kind of Olympic Games. Olympic Games <laughs> of uh, two of us. I think we will uh, uh, make a proper name for that, maybe a little bit different. But uh, yeah, uh, it was the idea of yours. Yeah, yeah. Like, like who knows us, we always competing in. Uh, weightlifting and running and just in everything everything yeah so and uh, lina said to me this morning that he can run faster than me after you said that uh, you can lift more than me so we decided that we when we go back to lithuania we'll train all summer and at the end of the summer we will see or it's going to be like last day of summer or first day of autumn it depends but we will try to completely compete in uh, different sports probably it's going to be some lifting running maybe hanging on the bar yeah maybe body weight exercises maybe even swimming or I don't know so we have still all summer to like uh, create uh, all this uh, that's our plan for today okay uh, yeah that's our plan for today uh, wait for other updates uh, we will update you sure Let's go and get breakfast. No, alarm cobra. Again, very Indian. Wow, it's tasty. You're the one who got poisoned by Indian food and cannot eat it right now, so don't complain. You've been poisoned too. No, I didn't. You've been sick 24 hours. I was um, uh, having just a little bit of diarrhea and even didn't vomit it, so I'm good. Ah, but you vomit it next day. It was different reasons. Uh, going to the hospital now. Nothing man. Or maybe not. <laughs> Super special. Primus. Primus. Yeah, Primus. Okay. Three people. Three people. Two fifty. Two. 
Only two. Need to change oil and some filters. Yeah, yeah. go take yes. chai or whatever. <laughs> Okay, let's go. I was just here <laughs> listening about that angry Russian woman talking on the phone. Oh. Uh, so she's very angry. Oh. Something L about L Ukraine? Letter. Sorry? Sorry about Ukraine? Something? <laughs> no. no. Uh, so, yeah, let's go. Oh, let's go. Yeah, so now we're in the hospital. Already probably two hours. Uh, but uh, I was like uh, keeping uh, our backpack safe and Linus was dealing with doctors so maybe you can uh, give us an update. Yeah, so basically um, we uh, met a few doctors, uh, they said uh, us to do x-rays, so we did it. Now we have everything in the papers and we are waiting for a doctor to check it out and uh, give some suggestions, you know, for the medicine or anything something uh, but unfortunately he's right now doing urgent operation for some child yeah so some child like running or running a <laughs> day yeah he is uh, so yeah we are waiting I hope that child will get better soon so yeah, we really could get soon. doctor at least we are the first here uh, near his table because there's huge crowd of Indians waiting for this doctor I and guess as well angry Russians and too. some angry Russians as well uh, I they didn't get their morning vodka probably yet. Probably those kind of Russians. <laughs> but yeah. uh, you and Russia subscribe. Yeah, you and Russia subscribe us, but if uh, you're not angry, then subscribe. Uh, but if you support Putin, you can f and uh, just well, basically you don't have proper uh, access to to yeah, YouTube. Yeah, they go have, to your uh, yeah, YouTube. go to your uh, YouTube, YouTube and watch your shitty uh, vlogs and and, uh, and and yeah. Yes. So, uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so we will update you. So yeah. And us. Basically, this hospital looks like every hospital that I've been in before in Lithuania or in other places. Yeah, because we're in private hospital. It would be more interesting. Is it really to be private? You say that it's private. Well, I'm not sure right now because it doesn't look like private. It's a Primo Super Specialty Hospital, as you can see. I'm not sure. I think it. it Oh, whatever. So yeah, it's a big hospital. They say it's good, but uh, it looks uh, 
Okay. Also okay. Also okay. 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 Here, sing because we don't have music for our video, so just uh, play some. Uh, oh, update from the hospital. Our mother is liar. Yeah. <laughs> She don't have a fracture or anything. Basically, we did X-ray, we did MRU or what, yeah, what is that? Like that? Some other, yeah. So basically, uh, uh, there's just um, problem with tissues, with with muscles. It's just you know, small like hit like that. And uh, I need to go to the doctor <laughs> now. So they gave uh, about thousand different pills, uh, gel, and uh, that's it. And yeah, we, we're good. Yeah, spent only four hours. Yeah, only four hours standing in the lines and, and doing nothing. Yeah. So now we'll go to pick up your like uh, one thousand tons uh, weight uh, backpack. Suit. Yeah. Suitcase. 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 Yeah. Luggage. Case. Luggage case. Very heavy, know, heavy, heavy, yeah, very heavy. So, yeah, our plan is to take that from a very special place, then uh, go back home. Oh, I think that was my ambassador. Um, yeah, go home, and then uh, we'll maybe still uh, uh, will repair our shoes. Maybe. Yeah, repair our shoes in the street uh, repairing place, and then we'll go to a restaurant, maybe Chinese restaurant. Yeah, <laughs> it's our uh, ill uh, mom. Yeah, healing herself. <laughs> yeah, healing herself. So then, um, yeah, see you soon. See you soon. Uh, hello, how are you? Okay, so basically they just left me because in the rickshaw there is uh, not enough space for three people in the luggage and uh, I'm walking to, to the place where we are living now and then probably we'll go to repair our shoes finally. Now we buy embassy of Ukraine in Delhi. Yeah. So you can see, uh, I've been here in the beginning of um, uh, Russian invasion. Uh, invasion? So I thought there is a special operation. <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, there is a war. War, not any fucking operation. So um, basically, um, you can see a lot of posters. Uh, in, in many languages, in Hindi too, uh, supporting in various um, methods. 
Uh, usually there's also a lot of flowers and I'm not sure why there are no flowers at the moment but uh, many people come and give flowers and, and uh, express support as, as, as they can as they can and uh, also a few times we came here with uh, with other embassies as a representative of, of different embassies also uh, other people also came just to um, light some candles uh, in the late evening and to stand and support talk with ukrainians themselves a lot of uh, ukrainians in india came also and they told us uh, absolutely horrific stories about their family who, who, who are still there who are fighting uh, about the killings about all the crimes that russians do so uh, it's it's really uh, it's beautiful and sad at the same time. Yeah, it's beautiful that local people um, express support. It's sad that uh, they the the these things happening and like uh, yeah, this uh, century. And yeah, and also they, uh, as I noticed, I, I was in a few protests against the Russian uh, invasion and in India. And it's good that they are happening, but it's sad that it's not happening uh, too often. And there are not too many Indians even knowing. Also, there are many Indians who even support Russia, yeah. mostly from RSS. Well, uh, at least I'm not sure about the situation right now. In the beginning, there were protests organized by RSS who supported Russian actions, which is very sad and it should be legal, I guess. Uh, it's uh, my opinion only. Uh, but uh, yeah, so I'm not sure what is happening at the moment. Uh, we are trying to inform as many Indians what is happening there from our perspective, from the perspective of people who grew up near uh, Russia and who knows uh, what it is uh, capable of, uh, nightmares basically. So uh, yeah, spread the news, help Ukraine, uh, send money to them, uh, uh, blue and yellow organization, there's many organizations that you can trust and uh, yeah, support Ukraine as much as they can. Slava Ukraine! Geram Slava! Uh, so this place is blue. Here we go. We can go to eat. Yeah, yeah, so we will come back. Uh, what time? Or Yeglu or Shayad here, Blue or Bus or maybe Clean. Clean? Yeah. Good owner. So now it's Hello, evening. Folks. Hello, folks. Now it's evening. As you can see, yeah. So basically, 
we half of the day probably a little bit more spent in the hospital uh, then we dealt with Lina's uh, suitcase yeah uh, everything cool with the suitcase it shows that it's uh, not more than 23 kilos which is the limit for airports yeah uh, but scales a little bit shady uh, yeah the scale was very very uh, old traditional scale which uh, might not be very uh, accurate. precise and accurate but uh, yeah it all should be good I think uh, I'll take the jacket my winter jacket from it and I'll go with it <laughs> it will be funny Delhi in plus 43 uh, and uh, yeah and uh, what else? Uh, we like repaired your shoes. Yeah, repaired my shoes. You can show the shoes. It's, uh, yeah. it's very shiny. Adidas. And we bought like too, many, too much of groceries. A lot. For yeah. uh, to almost 25 euros. Yeah, so basically, uh, what else? They will just uh, help be working uh, as much as they can. I'm tired already. And, uh, yeah, and tomorrow is going to be probably interesting day because, uh, like Lina said, if you want to say that you've been in India, you should see Taj Mahal. Yeah, basically you cannot say that you've been in India if you didn't saw Taj Mahal. Yeah, and so I think that th this is nonsense, but still we'll go to see Taj Mahal because you know it's a it's a big building big white building why not to see this <laughs> no like uh, it, it, uh, um, in fact it's really uh, one of the most interesting with a huge history very old uh, beautiful crazy like wonder of the world yeah yeah it's like wonder of the world so I think uh, we'll try to see because we're in Delhi and Agra is just a couple of hundred kilometers away maybe less so uh, yeah so the plan is that uh, we will try another uh, public transport is trains yeah uh, still we didn't book the tickets but I guess uh, uh, yeah uh, when will come I, I will order and yeah uh, this yeah. will be nice so there's possibility that tomorrow we'll go by train to Agra we'll see Taj Mahal and uh, so all day will be in Agra so it's going to be interesting day and uh, probably see you tomorrow probably see you tomorrow bye